In this video, I will show you the best overclock settings that I found for mining Toncoin on the Polaris RX 570 GPU. The first thing you need to know about Toncoin is that it only uses the core of the GPU. This means that the memory has pretty much zero effect on mining performance. The settings that I currently am running are 1100 megahertz on the core, 800 millivolts for core voltage, and 1750 megahertz for memory clock. The mega hash that we are consistently getting here is 730. 38. To prove my point about the memory, we're going to remove the memory overclock, hit apply, and we'll see what happens to the hash rate. After removing the memory overclock, you can see that the hash rate stays the same. However, the power consumption is significantly lower now on the rig. In software, you can see the power has dropped, but also measuring at the wall, sitting at around 106. And if you want to see what memory speed we are running now, is we can go to amd-info, and it'll show us here that for the memory clock, instead of running 1750 we are only running 300 because that is the state zero default on most players gpus which means we're using significantly less power because again the higher your clocks are the more power you will draw so that's why if you are mining toncoin the settings that i would finally recommend are 1100 megahertz on the core 800 millivolts for core voltage and to ensure that you're running at 300 megahertz you can just put that right here in the memory clock Overall, these settings are the most efficient that I could find while mining Toncoin on the RX 570 GPU. Now, if this video was helpful, please consider leaving a like. And if you are looking for more overclocking guides for the Polaris GPUs like the RX 570, I have quite a few on my channel for Ethereum Classic, Ravencoin, as well as Zergo. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Take care.